Hey, what's up everybody? It's the Hyphen here. And today we're gonna to talk about the Angular Boombox. It's an octagonal softbox that works well with monolight flashes, such as the AD600 Pro from Godox. Also works well with studio strobes and with LED lights, such as the very popular Aperture 120D. This light modifier helps soften and spread light more evenly, and with its shape, actually helps create a more pleasing catch light. The Angular Boombox is a great alternative to the Light Dome and to the Octabox, and it's significantly cheaper. This retails for only $100. On the inside of the Angular Boombox, you have an aluminum speed ring, aluminum rods, and the interior of the actual softbox is all silver. Also included is a deflector plate that can be mounted in either direction, depending on what type of light you desire. And there's a bolt here to lock that in. I personally normally put the reflector plate with the rounded part on the outside. And if you wanna soften your light even more, there's an extension for the reflector plate. And now the reflector plate is even further away, allowing a more spread diffused light. Personally though, I actually never use the extension. So aside from the actual diffuser on the edge of this boom box, you actually have a second diffuser to soften the light even more. This is an inner diffuser that has these little hooks that you kind of have to squeeze with your fingers. I personally am not really a big fan of these hooks because sometimes it's a little tough to kind of squeeze it open and then hook it through these little loops. So once you have the inner diffuser on, the outer diffuser is actually just Velcro. You go ahead and just stick that on. So personally, when I do a lot of my photo shoots, I actually use both diffusers on. Now, for any reason you actually need to get into the softbox without taking apart the diffusers, you have a zipper here that you can open. And now you can access your light or your reflector. So I've been using the Angular Boombox for quite some time now. I use it with every photo shoot when I use my AD600 Pro Monolight, and it works amazingly well. It holds up, easy to set up within just a few minutes, and it really helps make the light look a lot more natural and soft, making my portraits look even better. And a great thing I like about this softbox is that it opens and closes like an umbrella, making it very easy and quick to set up. The Angler Boombox comes ready for Bowen's mount, but they do have additional adapters that they sell, so you can put it on pretty much any other mount that you need. Angler also includes a very nice carrying pouch that is weather resistant, so if it's raining, you won't have to worry about it getting wet. The only issue I have with this bag is that it doesn't have a handle or a shoulder strap, so you have to pretty much carry it like this. It's very easy to transport, and it is pretty durable, though, I definitely would not want to bend the rods. So when I actually transport it in my car, I actually put it in the box that it came with. So I put it in this bag like this, and then I put it back in the box that it came with. So that way it has a little bit more protection when I'm putting a bunch of equipment together. So there you guys have it. That's the Angler Boombox. It's a great light modifier and it's very affordable while also working very well in various environments. I highly recommend it, and if you're interested in getting it, I do have links in the description where you can purchase it from either B&H Photo or Amazon. It doesn't change the price that you get it at, but it does help this channel. Please make sure to drop a like on this video, drop a comment below if you have any questions, and please make sure to subscribe. I have a lot more videos coming soon. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.